watch that video again. That was really way too dark. Didn't even see the uh, box turtles eating. They definitely can use a little bit more light. I'm almost, I am leaning the camera a little bit on that uh, box turtle right here while he's eating. But I'm able to hold the camera a little bit more steady when I rest it on him. Oh look, this guy finally decided to come up and try a bite of worm. Spooky. Seems like uh, these box turtles are rather, I don't know, clumsy feeders. They bite and they miss. <laughs> I don't see many humans eating that poorly. The best worm tastes best in another turtle's mouth. They really like to take it away from each other. Oh, there you go. <laughs> and he likes to eat the whole thing. You know, there's plenty of worms right to be had on the ground. Oh my gosh, that was a foot. This turtle just had his right rear foot chomped on really hard by that turtle right there. He is not sticking that foot out anymore. Ouch. I think that's the reason that these uh, box turtles have shorter tails too. They see each other's tails as something to bite off and so they bite them off. If I was to put these turtles onto uh, Craigslist to try to rehome. I uh, don't know what I would uh, tell them about. Um, they have very beautiful shells, but they, uh, I think they're, unless you're, well, even if you're breeding them, they're just best raised apart. All the worm has been eaten. I'll have to get another worm. Okay, I'm going to take a picture of him eating a full-grown worm. Maybe two against that worm will do it. He's going for the head. Oh, accidentally zoomed in. Well, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get this through the plastic, but uh, I think this worm has got the escape. He's trying to get the head. And it's in that corner there. Trying really hard to get in there to get it, but he can't do it. like there might be, well, no, that one fella has the head of a worm right there. This guy's got a great big one in his mouth, wiggling all over the place. Box turtles can feed underwater too. That's something that you don't always uh, see a red-eared uh, slider turtle. I understand that they uh, can only swallow their food underwater, that they don't do very well eating their food out of the water. Well, it's sort of fun to watch the turtles going after this big this night crawler here. It's not a great big night crawler, but 
Uh, it was interesting to see how uh, vicious they can bite each other on legs and things like that. My uh, two-month-old uh, box turtles, you know, that are just a little over, uh, are up here, and uh, they are not doing really well. Uh, they only like to eat mealworms, and I'm wondering how I can uh, list them on Craigslist too, and uh, see about rehoming them. The problem with uh, turtles is that it's quite difficult to uh, find a, a place or a person that has the, uh, I don't know, I like to give them to good homes, I really do, because uh, turtles are a long-term project. Uh, these turtles here will probably only live 60 or 70 more years. Uh, right now they're only two years old, and uh, box turtles live well over 50 years uh, in the wild, unless a car or something like that runs over them. And so I, I think that uh, rehoming some of these turtles is a, a really good idea. These little babies would be fine to rehome right now. Uh, they have really pretty uh, shells. But one of the problems with these uh, little uh, month old box turtles is that they're pretty pers persnickety when it comes to eating food. And they're very shy uh, turtles. It's uh, like they're turned around backwards right now. And I did put a couple uh, pieces of worm in here earlier, this small, but um, they prefer to eat mealworms. Anyway, I'd like to rehome these because right now my uh, enclosure in the backyard is, you know, it's quite large, but uh, I've got um, this. Uh, slightly successful box turtle raising uh, thing going on and just right here I have five little box turtles and four that are over a year old now. These four are I'd say are just perfect for adoption. Uh, but, uh, have to look into the legality of it all. Thank you.